Hey YouTube, Aviation 3.0 here, back with another River Polis Airport update. I believe this is my fourth or fifth update. Um, but uh, if you don't know where my airport is, it is called River Polis and it is in northern Minnesota, kind of near Minneapolis, St. Paul, but still a little to the north. Um, so let's get started. Here taking off, we have an Asiana Cargo 747-400 freighter. He's taking off for Cincinnati. Then here we have an American Eagle Embraer Air J175. He just he's about to head out to Boston. And then here we have a Delta 757 300. He got in from LAX earlier today, and he's gonna head out to Star Valley. That is a subscriber. That's a subscription route with um, Aviation 737. Then over there we have a Southwest 737 800 with split skimming tires. Um, he is going to head out to Oakland later today. So that concludes the aircraft that are flying. Um, so now we can move on to the grounded aircraft, I guess. Uh, here we have a Azerbaijan, Azerbaijan A340-600. Um, he's here and he's grounded. An Iberia A340-600 in the old livery. He's also grounded. Royale Air Maroc 787-9 Dreamliner in the new livery, grounded. Iceland Air, uh, 757-300, 100 years of independence livery, grounded. So, um, at, unlike the other update, the grounded planes were over here, but I don't know why, but the airport decided to move the grounded aircraft over here. Um, here we have a WestJet 787-9. Um, the tug is just putting him into his little slot position there and he's gonna be um, sitting here for a while. Now it is really unusual to ground aircraft in foreign countries. Like all these aircraft, these airlines are not US airlines because it's, so it's really um, unrealistic to have them grounded in other countries. But for fun, since I have not so many models, I just decided to have them grounded in. Kind of put the post-it notes on the engines as you can see here. So I think that's so that birds don't build nests in them when they're grounded, but um. So that concludes the update. Um, thank you for watching. Really sad, we have a ton of grounded aircraft and um, I don't have anything else to say. Yeah, this is really affecting the aviation industry. It's hitting it hard. Also, not only the aviation industry, but the rest of the world. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. As always, 